I hope you are doing well and staying safe. My name is Mohammad Reza Balichistani. I'm a professor uh, at the Georgian College. Uh, I received my PhD from the Ryerson University uh, in Toronto, Canada, and I was a postdoctoral fellowship uh, for two years in the SAR lab in the Toronto, Canada. Um, I have a diverse teaching and research experience for more than 20 years in the area of the Internet of Things and industrial Internet of Things and also wireless networkings. Uh, in this uh, proposal, uh, I proposed uh, a new IEEE protocol uh, for the wireless, wireless body area networks based on the new data acquisition uh, procedure which cars compressing uh, for IoT application. Uh, let me share my screen and uh, uh, show you some interesting files. As you can see, the name of the project, the Advanced IEEE Protocol for Wireless Body Area Network in IoT application. Uh, what is a wireless body area network? Wireless body area network is a good and wireless network which consists of a variety of the wireless sensors to collect and transmit and process and monitor vital signals and data from the body, such as uh, blood uh, pressure, uh, the ECG signals and uh, EEG signals, EMC signals, and so on. Uh, that's why the wireless body area network plays an important role in the new healthcare systems, such as electronic health, mobile health, and so on. Uh, in this new protocol, uh, I used the very interesting uh, and new data acquisition procedure, which is the compress sensing method, and also uh, this procedure and method cause random data. This is a new data acquisition procedure, which we can use in many real applications. Uh, that's why the wireless body area network uh, uh, collects some important vital data from the body, transmit this type of the data to the cloud, and monitor and process this time of the data. That's why uh, the wireless body area networks provides uh, um, different vital data uh, from the doctors and also phys uh, physicians. And the, the data could be available at any time at any web. Uh, the main motivation of this protocol is to replace the existing sampling and reconstruction operation with a general random linear measurement process uh, and, uh, and very interesting method which calls compress sensing uh, to, uh, to minimize the load of the sampling and also the power consumption of our system. In this work, uh, I combined comparison sensing theory to the wireless body area networks. I used uh, a frequency band between 2.5 megahertz to around 2,483 meg uh, megahertz, and also uh, developed a new protocol based on this uh, data acquisition Method. Uh, the quick story is here. Uh, instead of collecting all of the samples, bio samples from the body, this protocol collects only a random number of samples. For example, we have uh, in an ECG signal from our heart, uh, the total sample is around more than 1,000 samples. The existing protocol now collects all of the 1,000 samples. But our, our, our new protocol collects around, 10, around 100 samples instead of 1,000 samples. That's why, uh, based on the combination of the comparison sync theory and wireless body area networks, we are able to minimize the load of the sampling rate 
and also minimize the power consumption. Uh, based on the result of this protocol, uh, we are able to generate vital data to physicians and doctors at any time, at anywhere, by removing construction of the time and location of the patient, and by increasing both the mobility and the quality of the healthcare systems. Uh, uh, also, we are able to uh, uh, create a strong platform uh, for mobile health and also electronic health. And uh, uh, we are able to also combine uh, other type of the wireless sensors, such as wireless personal area network and wireless local area network to this type of the network, which is the wireless body area network. The conclusion is, uh, Based on this protocol, which is the, I think the beginning step of uh, the application of IoT in the healthcare system, uh, we are able to apply this protocol uh, for IoT application in the area of the healthcare. And based on this protocol, uh, the main goal is to minimize the power consumption in the side of the sensor in the transmitter side and also minimize the load of the sampling in our uh, system. Uh, this is very interesting uh, protocol uh, for IIoT as well in this serial Internet of Things in the area of the healthcare uh, sector. That's why uh, we are able to apply also this protocol uh, for uh, industry 4.0 or I4.0 and also for many real application in the area of the IoT. Uh, thank you, appreciate your time, have a good day.